Well, Gladys, first of all, congratulations. Just tell me how proud do you feel to be named as captain? Well, it's a big honor. I wasn't uh, expected, uh, expecting anything like this, and uh, it came to yeah a very good surprise. Um, of course, I'd said yes right away. I mean, this is, uh, uh, you know, as a player, as a person, it's a big thing, and uh, I'm really, um, really glad I'm going to do this. And um, yeah, I'm very honored, obviously. What's the importance of the tournaments for, for women's golf in Europe? Well, I think it's big. You know, first of all, it's a, it's a team event, so it makes uh, all the players get together uh, to represent one tour. And I think, uh, you know, despite everything, we have to be proud of the LET. The LET has done, um, you know, so many great things and that had, has, um, you know, come up with some awesome players. And I think this year the team is, is pretty strong. And I think, uh, you know, it's big for the tour. It's big for the girls themselves uh, as players. And uh, I think it's just, uh, you know, a lot of positive out of it. What's special about the tournament itself? I guess the players get together as a group and some players don't know each other that well and they get to know each other very well during that week, especially that happened last year. Yeah, I think it's a, it's a really good timing where you know you get all together and there's a really good atmosphere. Um, there's a pub across the street and uh, from the hotel and I know uh, we usually all get there and uh, have a drink together. Um, I think uh, it's uh, yeah, it's special to be able to play a tournament very, you know, to take it very seriously and at, at the same time have fun um, with the girls. So um, I think it's uh, yeah, it's fun for everybody and uh, the atmosphere is always really good. And what are the LET's chances this year? Do you think previous years obviously they've they haven't come in the top two. Last year heading into the final day they could have been. Yeah. Uh, so what do you think this year? What are the chances? Well, I think. Um, you know, everybody realized that it's possible to get into the, the top two. And uh, really, to me, it's everything is possible. And I looked at the team, you know, because I, I got uh, more interested. <laughs> and uh, I looked at the team and it looks really good. Um, I think uh, we have a good chance really to, uh, to get at least a top two. That'll be uh, really fun. And what will your style be as captain? What would be what? Your style as captain. I mean, what will you, what will you try and bring to the captaincy role? Well, I think the role of, the, of a captain is really to get the team together and uh, make everybody happy, uh, make the right pairings, uh, talk to the players, ask them what they want, what they don't want, uh, who they want to play with, if they have any preferences on anything, and uh, make sure, you know, like at night when you all get together, I think it makes a team grow. And um, I think that's really important because, you know, a team can be not as good, but can become really good if it's a real team. Would you, if it goes well, which I'm sure it will, would you like to perhaps use this as an example of what you could do as a possible Solheim Cup captain? Well, I think before being Solheim Cup captain, you have to be vice captain at least once or twice. Uh, you know, obviously I played four Solheim Cups and it's obviously the best thing I've ever played and it's always um, an honour to play it and it's always um, a big thing for me. So, of course, being a vice captain first will be a really will be really amazing but you know there are so many great players that can uh, bring a lot of things too it's uh, it's difficult I guess for the captain to choose and uh, you know I'm you know not many people know that but I can be patient sometimes and that's one thing I'm patient for so if it comes that will obviously be a, a really nice thing but I'm not gonna make a, a big deal if it doesn't happen.